Hello, I have a review. It's on the Wolf of Wall Street starring Leonardo DiCaprio and Matthew McConaughey. It has Jonah Hill. It has Ethan Suppley, who doesn't, that doesn't mean anything to a lot of people, but it means a lot to me because he was Frankie on Boy Meets World and I have I adore Ethan so much as as a um, character. I don't think he's really a character actor. He was on a show called My Name is Earl, which I have not seen. And he was like a supporting star in that. So I don't think he counts really as like a character actor. But um, he's just like... I mean, he is in the movie called American History X. So I'm kind of nervous to watch that movie on here. He's not the best of person in that movie but generally when I watch a movie and he kind of pops up in it he's such a happy guy like he's such a happy positive person so whenever he comes on anything I'm just like oh I love Ethan so much like he just I don't know I just think he's um he just seems like a very positive person so unhappy and like people seem to really like being around him so I just think he seems really cool. So I saw his name on the um I was looking at movies on Netflix I saw his name in the movie like where the actors are and I was like he is in this movie because I've heard of the movie obviously but I didn't know he was in it because like, obviously no one was gonna say that he was. I was actually surprised he was even listed because he's not even in it that long that much so I was kind of proud of him. I'm really proud of him that he was in a movie that was nominated for an Oscar. So, very proud of him for that. But, um, and then, I know there's probably some other people that I'm just not remembering right now. But, um, that movie was um, almost three hours. It's on Netflix, by the way. I'm actually surprised it's on Netflix because it's kind of like a big movie. But, um, and they do have those, but not like that often kind of like they wait a little bit before putting out those movies they this is how 2013 so it hasn't been out that long but uh so it's kind of interesting that it's on netflix right now um but um the problem is that it was almost three hours long um the acting was great like the movie i thought was really good but the problem is is that at a certain point in the movie, like, you know, it's like, I said, like I said, it's like almost the hour. There's a certain point during a long movie where I'm just like, I want to do something else. Like, I want to get up and do something else. Like, I want to move on from this. So, it kind of, it was kind of like, um, and it's towards the end, or in the middle, really, I was just like, can this movie end? Because I want to do something else. Like, I want to um, go downstairs and I want to, like, eat, have a snack. Like, I just want to do something besides what I'm, besides watching this. So, um, that was, uh, <laughs> that was a problem. I mean, I was, I was just kind of getting anxious waiting for it to end and I mean I got had my attention the entire movie really um and it was interesting and it was good and it was really really good great, greatly acted but it was just kind of like okay I get the point can you end can you just let it go <laughs> because I'm ready to move on with my life and um I mean, like, normally if we watch a movie in the living room, I pause it a bunch of times and, like, get up and do stuff because I'm like, I can't, I cannot deal with this whole thing right now. But I watch movies on my laptop in my room and I can't just, like, get up and leave because, um, my cat is right here and I don't know what he's going to do. So, so I'm afraid he's going to, like, do something. So, um... I couldn't just leave it <laughs> and I don't like just leaving movies on my laptop I like to finish the whole thing on my laptop and not get up because sometimes it ruins the pacing of the movie like Netflix will like 
freak out. It's like unpredictable sometimes for me. So sometimes if I pause it and I go down and I do stuff, I come back and it like doesn't want to cooperate with me and have to restart the laptop to finish the movie. So, you know, I don't like doing that. Kind of an annoying. So I just finished the whole movie. <laughs> And the whole like was like over an hour left, and all of this like, can you just stop? Like, can you end so I can move on with my life? So, <laughs> if you watch this movie, and you have, uh, you know, you I mean if you have the ability to pause and like go about your day, um. I recommend doing that because I got really anxious, like antsy and stuff after a while. But um, it was really well done, so <laughs> I recommend it. But uh, yeah, I give it two thumbs up. <coughs> um, I mean, I think it could have been shorter, let's be honest. It could have been, so like, yeah. But um, that is my review, and that is all. Goodbye.